Sean Hannity, um, who is a, a, a goon and a goober and, um, you know, looks like a uh, fire plug um, in a doctor's toupee from 1977. And um, I think... Uh, does Stutter and John call him Fred Flintstone? <laughs> I I honestly, I have to go with Barney Rubble on this one. But anyways, doesn't matter. Um, this is this is uh, him a couple of nights like ago. Like we've been saying. Um, and um, pretending that Fox News isn't the reason that uh, Republicans are dying at, at an enormously fast pace. Uh, he, uh, a quick clip due to uh, the Delta variant, because this asshole and everybody at his place of work have been telling people, you know, yeah, 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 I don't know, I don't know, vaccines, eh, for, you know, the better part of a year, whenever they bring on the, the you know, their, their hero, the former president, he's always like, I invented it, but don't do it. And, uh, but you should, I mean, think about it, but you know, it's no good. Um, and here he is. This is, we, some of us may have caught this. I didn't get to go through the clip itself um, uh, because I didn't want to waste my time with it, quite frankly, because I didn't think it was going to last. And lo and behold, here we go. Thank you very much. Uh, thanks so much, Lauren. Like we've been saying, please take COVID seriously. Yeah, that's what you've been saying. What? I mean, starting off right out of the gate, just, just the horse is backwards in the stall, the gun goes off, and the horse runs out of... The, the gate ass first like we've been saying when i can't say it enough enough people have died we don't need any more death oh good okay i i'm glad to know there was a quota did it uh, did it, does fox have a thing on the wall that says we, we definitely got to call the herd we're gonna have to we're gonna have to scoop some uh people off the cliff uh is there is there a, a lemming march anytime soon how many how many is the, what was the number you were trying to reach with all your bullshit for the last year, Sean? How many people were you like, okay, uh, we're not there yet. We need a few more dead. Ah, now we've hit it. Okay, cool. Okay, slow down. Oh, you're overdoing it. Why? Well, we're killing the, the hicks with money now. See, just like the, the, you know, the fentanyl and opioid epidemic, we were hoping that, you know, that would help us, uh, upper class New Yorker types like him as much as he pretends to be down home like Huckabee and that bullshit Bubba nonsense that they do. Um, this is how they, you know, clear out all the the poor white trash. You know what I mean? That Appalachian land is amazing. I mean, you could have a, I mean, a mountain resort there. You know, it'd be like a, you know, amazing just kind of you know vacation spots instead of rolling hills it's beautiful if it wasn't for all those poor white trash in them you know what we could do is just let this roll for a little while talk them out of getting a vaccine and then you know and it will just we'll buy up the land at fire sale prices uh-oh it's killing some of the white people with money that we count on to oh shit all right time to tap the brakes Research like crazy. Talk to your doctor, your doctors, medical professionals you trust based on your unique medical history, your current medical condition, and you and your doctor make a very important decision for your own safety. Take it seriously. You also. Yeah, and uh, by doctor, he means uh, a real doctor. Not your buddy who's on Facebook a lot, who's a podiatrist. Of a right to medical privacy, doctor-patient confidentiality is also important. And it absolutely makes sense for many Americans to get vaccinated. I believe in science. I believe in the science of vaccination. By the way, that asshole and everybody else at Fox has been vaccinated, period. I, I believe in the science of vaccination is a bunch of shit because... A lot of them do too. They'll, they'll take the measles vaccine or other stuff. I mean, there's a, there's those little pockets of rednecks and and right wingers and 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 arguably the uh, uh, black people that have been bullshitted into. The, yeah, Tusk. What happened to the Tuskegee Airmen is reason for you to not get vaccines. Like, I mean, if that doesn't sound like a, a soft peddling passive eugenic white supremacy plot to get black people to not take vaccines that will save their lives, I don't know what does. But yeah, there are those pockets of those assholes. But the vast majority of them get, I mean, they're looking at the shingles vaccine ads every day going, I, I, I should get that, March. 
They're all doing that. So the si saying you believe in the science of vaccines doesn't mean you trust this one. Again, this is cowardice. As much as this was like, oh my God, look who's coming out for vaccines. He's not. Look at this. Uh, Hannity was on last night strongly suggesting, first of all, there's no such thing as a strong suggestion. Oh, um, what is there? A weekly ordering it would, would be more helpful. People to get the vaccine. No. To trust the science of vaccines, maybe. If he was strongly suggesting people get the vaccine, he would have said, I've been vaccinated. But he didn't. Because Sean Hannity is a coward. And that's not just me saying it. Uh, let's see. Let's uh, go back on here. Let's see. I'll go back one page. Beg your pardon. And then, uh, let's see. Mm -hmm. I can find this. It's in here somewhere. Um, here he is. Uh, just one night later, after backlash from uh, the, the QAnon crowd that basically own Hannity at this point, this was the, the, this is the very next day. What'd you say? These reports are all false for multiple reasons. First, but then this is Hannity. This is on foxnews.com. Hannity urges Biden to just thank Donald Trump for Operation Warp Speed. No Trump, no vaccine, Joe. Okay. Um, I touted Operation Warp Speed since the beginning. In January of 2020, I was predicting that I had so much faith in American researchers, the medical community, scientists, and as you... And, and, uh, and hydroxychloroquine and, and, uh, and basically any fish tank cleaner. It was my prediction that it will likely be American ingenuity and genius that will help us find therapeutics and vaccines and answers. And I pray... Yeah, the answers. That's what you're really looking for. Um, by the way, the first uh, doses came from uh, a lab in Belgium. Praise the efforts of all of these scientists and medical professionals. Those. Are yeah, the efforts. That's not the same thing, asshole. Involved in developing therapeutics. Uh, and therapeutics again. This whole, like, you don't need it. If you get sick, you'll get some monoclonal antibodies. You'll be just fine. Never mind long haul COVID. Never mind COVID brain. Never mind you, you know, it boring holes in your brain and you ending up with impulse control later on. And now, nah, yeah, yeah, who cares? The three vaccines that are now on the market and literally dozens of others. Uh, in terms of therapy. No, not literally dozens of others. Oh, in terms of therapeutics. But I never. Yeah, a vaccine is not a therapeutic and vice versa. God damn. I never told anyone to get a vaccine. I've been very clear. I am simply not qualified. I am not a medical doctor. Every day this asshole is saying Biden has dementia. Every day this asshole. <sighs> not a medical. Like, how long will we have to wait? What? Was it in the same episode? He medically diagnosed someone? How, and by the way, how do you have to be a fucking doctor? If you go, if you have any, um, if you have any concerns about, you know, issues that you might have, talk to your doctor. But I recommend the vaccine. How hard is that? And here's the other thing, Sean. Say to your people, I've been vaccinated. You should talk to your doctor, but I trusted it enough to put it into my body. But he won't say that because he's a fucking coward. I know nothing about your medical history. Or God damn, it's so weak. This is like when, when you get in an argument with somebody and they go... You know, I never said I was perfect. Like, you know, that's the they're the back out of it, you know. <laughs> yeah, we're not arguing about perfection. We're we're arguing about um you being rude to waiters. Not that there's a perfect way to, for you to be rude to waiters. You know what I mean? <laughs> Fucking hell. Just a douchebag. All right, here we go. Or your current medical condition. I think it's inappropriate for me to do so. Um, then don't diagnose Joe Biden with dementia when he has a stutter, asshole. Instead, over for over a year now, I have been warning my... Was last year over a year? Um, congratulations, ladies. I, I know there's, you know, International Women's Day, but I had no idea we had over a year last year. Viewers, you may... Sorry it happened in fucking COVID, but I mean, 
Can't women get a break? Make my career possible. I want every American, liberal, conservative, Republican, Democrat, I want you to be healthy. I have seen the worst of this virus in people that I love and care about. And to take COVID-19 seriously, and I've said it over and over and over again. It's not been in the last week. I said to take it seriously, to do your own research. There's a ton of it right on, you know, at the tip of your fingers on your own phone. Look at all of the studies. Consult your doctor or doctors. Consult medical professionals. That Have you ever said, has Sean Hannity ever said he got vaccinated on the air? You trust. And based on your specific medical history... Here's your medical history. Uh, you've been alive until COVID showed up and you would like to be alive after. And health issues. That will be an important decision uh, with you and your doctor based on your very unique and specific circumstance. No. Some people have very unique and specific circumstances that they have to look into this. But the vast majority of people don't. You're, you, you know what? The one unique circumstance we all share right now we're all in an epidemic we're in a pandemic that's your unique situation stances i've had many doctors on this program some that i agreed with and some that i disagreed with and i pelted them did you get the vaccine you ass hat with questions about COVID-19 and the vaccine and therapeutics, hydroxychloroquine, ivermectin, Regeneron, etc. And Regeneron's a, country, uh, a company, not the actual... God, we, we passed on the information to inform people on how all Americans can stay healthy. Here's just a small... Does anybody know? Has, I, I mean, I, for God's sake, at no point did this asshole say, I've been vaccinated, I recommend it, but you need to check with your doctor. That You can still do that caveat and still admit that you've been vaccinated. But if Sean Hannity admits he has been vaccinated, these people are going to chew him up and spit him out.